So we're going to take it way back to when I was working out with a lovely group of moms here in High River out of uh, George Lane Park. We're going to go and do some AB cardio. So uh, you don't need anything, just body weight. Uh, kid, always helpful. They need gym class too, right? And we can't always kick them outside. Also, uh, interval timer. So 30 seconds of working, 30 seconds of resting. I'm going to have a little bit of music playing on here as well. And uh, make sure that you get your warm up in. So jumping jacks, running on the spot. Uh, if you have stairs in your house, make, break all the rules, run up and down the stairs. Make sure you have water. Make sure you have your water, yes. All right, so Coach Hadley and I are going to get started. We've already done our warm up, and I think what we'll do moving forward is we'll actually do a video of a warm up that everyone can do and just get used to. But um, hold tight, there's lots of other things going on. All right, so uh, interval timer, ready to go, music going. And uh, let's start with squat jumps. Might as well kick it off really good. All right, three, two, one. Into our squat jumps. So we're going to squat down and then we're going to jump up, pushing the ground away. Up and down. Yep. Chest up, butt down. 30 seconds. I can't do it. You can do it. Keep trying. It's just trying. That's all. Our resting or our holding position is going to be down dog. All right, into down dog. So, hands out. We're gonna try and have our feet pressed down. Butt up, head through the shoulders. There should be no tension in those shoulders. I can't, I can't. Do my whole That's okay, you're doing Because good. it hurts my legs. If you can't, get straight legs. Soft bend in the knees. Put your toes down. Knees back. <laughs> You're going to stay on the ground after this? It's okay. That's, what we, that's why we do it, so we can stretch. All right, feet up, crunch. Feet up. I can't really do Trying to keep those legs stable. I can't really do this. If you can't do it, bring your heels down and think of trying to bring the chest up off the ground. Nice and strong. You can put your hands, so then put your hands at your side and relax. <laughs> Small movements are better than big ones. All right, cobra. What's a cobra? Right here. Press hands through the side and then open up, looking to the sky. It's easy. Is it easy? Perfect. I need to see. If this hurts, you can go into sphinx. So forearms down, shoulder blades driving down to your spine or to your hips and holding there. All right, we're going straight into star jumps. You can do this. Make a star, make a star, make a star. Don't hate your ceiling. <laughs> Jumping. Make sure you're breathing. <laughs> Good kiddo. All right. Forward fold. Big inhale, reach. Exhaling as you fold forward. Let it all hang and shake out. cheeks. I can do this. There you go. You can hold your superman too. Perfect. <laughs> You're going to go up into down dog. What's pressing it? through the toes. So kiddo, we're going to go. Okay, so go here and do this one. So push your butt back, 
and then drop your head through your arms. There you go. Just rest. Don't, it doesn't have to hurt. All right, from here, we're flipping into crab walk position, alternating toe touch. If you don't want to try that, you can go into bum drops from crab walk or just working on the leg lift. Can I go like hands inside? Yeah, you can do legs out, legs in. Are you going to do the thing where you... Come on up into deep squat hold. Mom. Or as our Olympic lifters call, Russian baby maker. Mom. Yeah. Um, can, are you going to do like when you pick me up in the Probably not for this one. In 10 seconds, you're going to lie down onto your left side. And we'll do um, left side oblique crunches. Which way is left again? With your hand. Where's the elf? This way. This side. <laughs> All right, on your left side, side oblique crunch. So we can have that forearm out in front of us. Don't be on your hip bone coming up and down. If you want to make it harder, take the hand off. Come all the way up. Okay, do what speaks to you right now then. What movement do you want to do right now? I know. There you go. I taught her. Oh, I barely got to do it. I taught her wrestler's bridge and now she's a fan. So we're gonna go side open, stretch. I just doing it this. That looks painful to me. It is <laughs> Oh, that's much better. On to your other side for those ugly crunches. Yay! I get more time to do. <laughs> there you go. Are you do the push up? I taught her wrestler's push up before we started. And now I think she's hooked. <laughs> so, parents, if you have kids that you need to have working out or doing something, Guide them, but let them kind of figure out what they feel is right for them as well. Let them listen to their body. Let them create movements and be the little artists that they are. Right now, this is just self-expression time. Let them do it. Yeah. All right, plyo push-ups for the last round before break. So we're going to do push-up, come up, hop off the hands. I can't. If you can, I'm clap your hands. If you're not ready for that, just do push-ups. It's okay. We'll be fine. Oh, I can do the... All right, child's pose. Butt back. You said we're gonna... Hands forward. Walk the fingertips out as far as you can. Ow. <laughs> Is it stretching? Yeah. Yeah. All right, take a breather. We're going to do a minute rest, and then we'll do one more round.